so today I'm going to be doing my February favourites. The month of February went really quickly, probably because it was only 29 days. Leap year, whoop whoop. So yeah, because I've got quite a few favourites, let's just get started. First, I'll start with not makeup or skincare, I'll start with random bits. First random bit are Werther's Originals. These are basically butter candies that come in little packets like this. Classic candy made with real butter and fresh cream. And I've been loving these lately. I got this packet like two days ago. <laughs> the next not beauty favourite is... This makeup bag, my friend got me this from Skegness and I just think it's really cute and it's like really big and I can fit a lot of stuff in here including like mirrors and sprays and floral and it says fill with pretty things so thank you Charlotte, it's very nice. Now on to skincare, simple kind of skin purifying cleanser and toner. These I got a few days ago but still in February and I love them. I got these at Morrison's, they were like £3 each so they work so well and I use these at night. Then I follow up with simple kind of skin hydrating like moisturiser. Oh look, it's a brand deal, it's not actually. They're quite cheap because they're £3 each. Obviously you can get cheaper ones like Boots Dear one for a pound. So if you didn't want to pay that much then you don't have to, they'll be cheaper alternatives but they aren't that expensive. As you can tell I'm not wearing any makeup, that's because my this eye is really hurting me so I took my makeup off. Sorry if I'm kind of hurting your eyes a bit and you've already clicked off of this video. The next thing before we get on to makeup is Vaseline. This is petroleum jelly. Yeah, I got this from Morrison's, it was really cheap. It's all good for your lips. I just put this on at night and in the morning, but I don't take this to school because I don't want to just be getting in my lessons and just start going like that. I just use a stick lip bar. Yeah, really good. You can, if you watch like 10 things to do with Vaseline or petroleum jelly, it's amazing. You can literally put them on anything. Now on to makeup. First, I will start off with lipsticks. I have got two MAC lipsticks this month that I'd be loving. You can probably guess what they are already. First one is Diva. This is a matte formula. I currently have two of Diva. And this was my, this one was actually my first lipstick. So it is nearly running out, but I don't mind. I love how this is matte and it looks good with any makeup look. Except from pink eyes, I don't think it looks very good with pink eyes. But with golden eyes, silver eyes, it looks amazing. So my next lipstick is Cyber. It is a satin finish and it is a very, very dark vampy purple. Um, I love it. It's almost black. I just want to wear a black lipstick. <laughs> As this is satin, it goes on a bit lighter than this. Um, and it's easy to remove. It doesn't stain your lips like Diva does. But it doesn't come off that easily, so perfect. So now moving on to eyes, I'll start off with mascaras. I have got two Benefit mascaras. First one is a mascara primer. This is the Benefit Their Real Tinted Primer. It is a brown like gel thing and it basically helps get your mascara on the whole day. I couldn't live without this now. I love it. I never want it to run out. And then on the top of that I put my Benefit Roller Lash. I love the wand, I love the pinkness. It's just so pretty and elegant. I much prefer it to the Their Real actual mascara or the bad girl i just this is my favorite so i wear that every day carrying on from eyes i have eyeshadow stuff first thing is a cream eyeshadow this is the maybelline 24 hour color tattoo in on and on bronze a really nice bronzy color and i like to do this when i'm doing golden looks and it's really creamy and it's a good base for your eyeshadow these are about five pound i think which is quite good for what you get like MAC ones I think cost like £20 or maybe even more so yeah it's really worth it. Then my eyeshadow palette of the month is the W7 in the buff palette. This is a dupe for the naked two. It has 12 really stunning shades. And my favourites are Camel and Topaz. I like to put Camel all over my eyes above my colour tattoo and then Topaz in the outer corners and then blend it all together and it looks really pretty and I wear that quite a lot. I do a lot of looks in here. This was like £6 or something, so it's a lot cheaper than a naked palette. So now on to brows. What I have been running through my brows some mornings is the Maybelline Brow Drama. This is basically a sculpting brow mascara. It is in dark brown because I have dark brown brows. But yeah, this is just a really weird shaped wand. And you basically just brush through your eyebrows with this and it gives them good shape. And I normally wake up and my brows are literally like either sticking up, sticking that way, and it's just like, that's really uh, good. But yeah, highly recommend it. Don't think it's too expensive, I'm not too sure. Quinn bought it for me. I've also got my eyebrows threaded this month for the first time. I thought it was gonna kill, but it actually didn't. So yeah, I recommend getting your eyebrows threaded because waxing causes acne, so I wouldn't get acne, I wouldn't get waxing, and it also rips off the top layer of your skin, so yeah. 
get this ready guys. Going along with eyebrows, I have been currently highlighting my brow bone um, some days when I put this on. And this is a really pretty highlighter, it is Benefit High Beam and this, like, this is just a mini, I'm going to get the full size but it's 18 plus 50 and I don't have that much at the minute. But yeah, this is just really nice, I love it, it is a perfect highlighter, so yeah. The primers I've been loving this month are, I have been loving the Collection Primed and Ready in Cool Rose and the Benefit Professional. I got this because I've nearly finished my Professional. I just wanted to get it so that I could mix those two together so it kind of waters this down a bit so I don't use it as quickly. And yeah, this was only £4, you can see the size difference. But yeah, I love them both together, keeps your makeup on the whole day, and um, makes your skin look less floorful. Love it. Next, I've been loving the Tanya Burr Cosmetics Rosy Flush Cheek Palette. This has a shimmery bronzer, um, a blush and a highlighter. I have only ever used the blush. I've not tried these two yet because I've got the Hula Bronzer and the High Beam Highlighter. So I've not tried those out yet. I love the blush. It's so pretty and uh, it's not very like pigmented so it won't make you look really like pink so I don't mind that and this is in Pretty Peony I highly recommend these I think it was seven pound or something I got it for Christmas so I don't know and finally I've got my powder this is the Rimmel Stay Matte powder everybody knows about this I hated it until like a month ago when Quinn gave me one and I love it it's so good I love it yeah fabulous now I've also been loving roses I first got my red rose for Valentine's Day, I bought myself it. And then mum gave me some of her flowers and they also died. So I bought myself some white roses and they haven't died yet. And I just put them on my bedside table. So yeah, that's it for today guys. Thank you for watching. Remember to get a massive thumbs up and comment and subscribe. Press all the buttons down there. Except for the dislike one. I will see you on Friday. Goodbye. Mm -hmm.